What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Miss B Mac, and I'm coming at y'all today with um, just a small video of some new items I got that I was really excited about, and I couldn't wait to show. So, first of all, I want to apologize about the bad lighting in this video. I am not at home. I am I'm out of town in this hotel room. Even though it has like 17 lamps in the hotel room, uh, it's still really dim. And so I have all the lights on, two of the lamps I took the shades off of, and it's still as bright as I could get it. So anyways, just real quick, um, since I'm out of town, I found my first Mac store. And so I got my uh, first, It's not. it wasn't even a Mac store, it was just they had a Mac counter inside a department store. So I was really excited about that. And then just some drugstore items I got that I'm really excited about. So uh, first of all, these are all, of course, color icon because I am falling in love with the color icon Wet n Wild uh, 3 and now 8 Pan palettes. So I went and got this one which is uh, walking on eggshell and I got this one because I already had the I I think it's called I love candy or something like that sweet no sweet light candy uh, three pan color icon palette and uh, these colors are really similar only in the I love candy the bot the eyelid is like a, a, a pink and then a darker brown and this brow bone color is more uh, cream whereas the other one is more white but since that one looks really good like on me I really like that one I decided you know stick with what I what I know and so I went and got this one so that I can switch them up some time depending on what I'm in the mood for and not worry about looking crazy but I also since I was there I decided to try one of the eight pan and because these light if this lighting is so bad you can't even really see the colors but this is the petal pusher one the one with the purples in it and this has some really really pretty purple and pink and I am just so excited I've had it for a couple of days and I haven't yet opened it just because I haven't had time to um, play with it the way I like to play with new eyeshadow before I wear it in public and so I haven't had time to play with it yet but when I do like I, I'm just so excited because there are so many different combinations you can come up with with these eight different um, colors so I'm really excited about this and this one is of course $4.99 as everyone knows the three pan is uh, $2.99 or $3 depending on where you get it from and then also in the color icon family I got these two pencils and they're supposedly um, eye pencils but this amethyst I went out and I wanted it because I saw a girl using it as lip liner and I was like, oh, that's really cute. And I couldn't find it with the lip liners because, of course, it's an eyeliner. And so this is amethyst. You can, I mean, I, I've used it as eyeliner and lip liner. Yeah, it was kind of gross or whatever. So I've used it as both, and it's just really pretty. It's just really pretty. It's, it's looking really dark on here, but it's a really light, you know, darker than lavender, lighter than violet type of purple. And it's really pretty, and it looks really good on your eyes as well as, as a lip liner. So this is Amethyst. This was 99 cents. This color icon pencil also was 99 cents. And as you can see, it's much shorter. And that's because this one isn't your regular eye pencil. This is um, a, a shimmer eye pencil. So it has a little bit of glitter on it. This I've also used to um, put on my lips to see what it would look like. And I've also put on my eyes. And I think it actually looks better on lips just because you know it has that little bit of shimmer in it which I don't really see a lot of shimmery lip pencils and so it looks good I mean of course it does look good you know on eyes too um, I tried it on the waterline it didn't really show up that well on the waterline but I, I'll try it again and just you know see if I can get it to work but oh and this is in the color um, copper and so this is 99 cent as well of course much shorter because it's a little glitter but whatever Okay, that's all the wet and wild stuff. Like I said, today I went to the Mac counter inside a department store, and I spent a lot of time in there with this girl who was, you know, working on colors and um, pressed powders and stuff with me because right now I don't really wear foundation or powder, and I really would like to start, but I don't want it to look like I have a lot of makeup on when I wear powder, and I also don't want to be looking crazy, and then I also don't want to look you know like an old sick woman on the days that I don't have the powder on so that's why I'm so reluctant and trying to ease my way in but I, I really like what she um, put on me today but anyway I also was introduced to some different eyeshadow colors and I bought two I've been looking at them online and I just didn't know which ones would look good on me but you know she helped me out today and so I bought two the first one I bought is like you know uh, just a 
a lid color or a um, highlight color, and that is, um, I think it's called Naked Lunch. Like, I haven't even taken them out of the box yet. But it's called Naked Lunch, and like I said, it looks darker because of the lighting in the room, but there it is. That's Naked Lunch. This, she put it on me, and I have like four different eyeshadows on that I didn't have on when I went in because she kept trying stuff on me. So, you can't really see that I have the Naked Lunch on, but when she puts the Naked Lunch on, on top of the Color Icon palette that I already had on, like, it just looks so good. And so, I'm really excited about it. So, Naked Lunch is the first one I bought. And then the second one, which is the one that you can obviously see that I have on now underneath the darker one, is this one. And I think this one's called Electric Eel. Oh, yeah, there it is. <laughs> Electric Eel. And it's this really, really pretty, really, really bright, just really out there, look at me, blue. I told her I wanted like a, a more neutral highlight or whatever, or um, lid color that was, you know, just not as um, bold. And then I wanted one of those, look at me, I'm wearing eyeshadow, I'm brave, you know, I'm out there kind of eyeshadow colors. And so that's when the electric eel came in. So, hoo -hoo, I'm really excited about these, so I can't wait to wear them. I mean, she put them on me today, so I'm making sure that I don't really mess it up. My eyeshadow looks much better than it does um, here. You know, it doesn't look as good on camera as it does, yeah, in person. Um, and then I just bought a lip gloss, a luster glass in the color. Morning Glory. And it's um a shimmery pinkish shimmery pinkish purple lavender ish color. And I got it home and realized the only other MAC product that I own outside of um I have a, a luster glass now that my aunt gave me that's called like Shimmer Girl or some kind of shimmer girl color. And it's just basically um like a gold tint with like glitter and sparkles in it but the only other one that I own that I bought myself is a luster a luster glass no a dazzle glass cream lip gloss in the color Gone Romantin which is a lavender color basically with you know the little pearl glitter things in them um, which is um, a little bit bigger than this one that's the only one other one I own and I held them up together and then really close only this one is much more pink it's a little it's lighter and it's more pink than the Dazzle Glass Cream I have, which is a little more towards uh, the purple side, um, but also has that like lavender undertone, and then still has the sparkly stuff in it. So um, I tried a lot of them on, like put them on my hand and stuff, and I just didn't like any of them except this is the one I like the most. So I guess I'm just drawn to pinkish purple um, glittery colors, and so I got it home. Now I'm gonna keep it. So yeah, I got three new Mac items, and then I got four new Wet n Wild color icon items so I'm just really happy and really tickle pink and my friends who are in the room next to me are calling so I'm gonna have to go ahead and cut this video short so I can answer the phone so that's all I'll be back soon with a new video this is Miss B Mac and I'm over now